your damaged goods, damaged should have never been Thought you were bulletproof, look at you, what happened? Did she hurt you? Are you okay, baby? Everyone gets hurt, that's how we learn to make love work It's part of life, but if you need a lullaby Baby, don't cry no more Just let her walk out your door Baby, don't cry no more Mama's here I wrote a lullaby for you
to know how you're feeling To know if you're losing or winning Left behind or within it If you're sinking or swimming Existing or living Nothing that they could do Nothing that they could say Nothing that they could do To take all the pain away Sometimes it works out and sometimes it don't Sometimes you win some and sometimes you won't But we could be everything, everything, anything that we see We could be, we could be everything that we want We could be everything, everything, anything that we see We could be, we could be anything that we want But we could be everything, everything, anything that we see We could be, we could be everything that we want We could be to my blog thank you so much for so joining us um on spending a day with us yes spending a day with us anyways i hope you guys as will enjoy this vlog and have it as and are still enjoying it thus far and yeah please don't forget to subscribe and join the family yeah <laughs> don't forget to join guys and subscribe don't forget to hit the subscribe button it's absolutely free it's absolutely free to join this amazing family and be part of us anyway stay tuned and hope that you enjoy this short vlog and i hope that you guys will watch till the end anyways bye for now um what i'm gonna do right now okay i need to what is she eating but please take it out Ah, but it's not going to do anything to her, it's big. She likes everything that she touches, she eats, guys. She's at that stage where everything is yeah. long I don't know, should we take it out? Hmm? Okay, I'll take it. Anyway, say hi to the vlog, Mali. Say hi to the vlog. <laughs> Hi vlog! Oh guys, I've got gorgeous kids. Look at me. Yeah. Anyways, I I need to look. I need to make dough now for fat cooks. We're gonna make fat cooks today. Anyway, stay tuned and enjoy.
that you're alone You're on my phone, running game But maybe, baby, when it settles in That you're to blame We could move on Pick up where we went wrong Baby Everyone gets hurt That's how we learn to make love work
Constantly. Constantly. Say it again. Constantly. Constantly. That's it, right? Constantly. Constantly. Consistently. 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 Yes, consistent. Yes, you don't cross the sins. Consistently, okay. You do not be posting consistently. Yeah. You do not be casting the sins in New York constantly. You do not go casting the sins. You do not be casting the sins constantly.
Guys, e Elan Kaya my door has in your case. I'm not sure what is in you guys in English. It has risen or what? It has risen. It has risen. Look at it guys. It has gone up. Very up. So now I'm going to start making um my landok. I'm going to start making my landok. What is this thing? Fat cooks. So yeah. Right now I just need to make a hair bottle and yeah, she needs to have a bottle now. Milk. Anyways, hope you guys are still enjoying the vlog. Please don't forget to subscribe and join the family. Please. Thank you. See you now now. Cause I don't wanna be sitting alone. I don't care what road you choose. Don't wanna go back to who I was before. Problems is and goes and goes. We need to put on tights and goes. We need to put on tights, girl. Guys, now I'm about to make a land dog. I'm about to make a what am I gonna make about um, 
this one wants my attention. Oh, rather she wants my soul. So yeah. Say hi, vlog. Okay, guys, I'm gonna make uh, fed soups now. I'll take you along and show you how I make fed cooks, just in case you don't know. Some of y'all don't know how to cook. I know you. You guys don't know how to cook. So I'm going to teach you how to make fed cooks. I think you saw when I made my dough. It has risen now. Wait a second. What's wrong? What's wrong? It has risen now, so I'm going to make fed cooks now. Anyway, guys. Stay tuned. See you now. Now, yeah, forget to look up. My baby's crying. What's wrong? <laughs> oh, she's shouting me, guys. Anyways, I'm doing that now. I'm five for now, guys. I am about to make the fat cooks, as I said. Um, always when I make fat cooks, I use Ohat. I've got three pots of Ohat in my flat. So I use Ohat because Ohat is the best, best, best pot ever. Uh, more than these fancy pots, especially to do Amagwenya. I don't know. For me, it is. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, I'm going to use that. And so let me show you. Sometimes when I'm thinking about us Before we got lost and we parted Back to back we would carry on then We'd do anything for what we started But this time we could break Wingers are coming good <laughs> anyways i've got a duke on because i was basing my hair i'm gonna do a sit down today i think i did mention that but if i did not mention that i'm gonna to be doing a sit down and yeah so i need to look good in my wingers how are my wingers guys are they nice how are the wingers do you like it can you make a queen Nani, how am I going? Yeah? Are they nice? When's that? When's that? When's that? When's that? Guys, I've got gorgeous kids. Guys, I'll show you when we're done. I think, you, okay, okay. I think you guys did see that I can make a maquinha. And I think you guys did learn how to make a maquinha. So yeah, I'm just catching up with the girls. I love her a lot. I love her content. And I don't want to skip the ads because I want the YouTubers that are already monetized to make money. Make that money so it's not fair for us to skip the ads because it means we are not pouring into their cup. And to make a content, it's such a lot of work. I'm asking you guys to please 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 subscribe on my channel help me grow um, when you subscribe to my channel I get motivated I like to see my channel grow I love to see like in the town to town that guys need so when you guys are subscribing you make me feel good please don't get tired of subscribing I know that I'm not consistent um, I think I did explain that on my last vlog that I am a full-time employee, my work is very demanding, and I'm also a mom to two girls, and that is also another work that is very demanding, so it's not easy for me to be, to vlog all the time, guys, but yeah, I want to, oh, sorry, 
but anyways i love youtube so i'm gonna continue um doing this thing even if i may hit eight days late or nine days late but i'll always post something and i am sorry for not being consistent in like i've got this little one this one demands me a lot a lot a lot so that's not easy guys but anyways yeah hope you guys are still enjoying the contents please don't forget to subscribe please please double tell them to subscribe tell them to subscribe is that come come tell them about over subscribe please ask them nicely <laughs> ask them nicely <laughs> On my mommy's channel. On the channel. Whose channel? I don't know whose channel. Wow. But yeah, so yeah, y'all. So you, how can you tell them to subscribe on a channel they don't know whose channel is it? Subscribe and comment down below and yeah, tell the man to subscribe. Hope is liquid and she won't be able to talk. <laughs> Tell them to subscribe. <laughs> Yo! Yo! Hope is liquid, yeah, guys. She won't be able to say anything. <laughs> <laughs> Tell them to subscribe. Tell them to subscribe. It's a new day. Anyways, I like her a lot. Please watch her content. She's amazing. And she's gorgeous. Thank you. Oh, look at her. Anyways, let me go finish up the mug. Yes, I'll show you when I'm done, guys. Anyways, bye for now. Bye for now. Hope you guys are enjoying spending a day with us. This is not bye. We'll see you now. No, no, no. This day is still young. Ne? Another day, another vlog, another money, another subscriber. Anyways, <laughs> bye for now, guys. Hey guys, vlogging is a lot of work. Right now, I am thinking of freshening up and doing a sit down because I promised you guys a sit down. But I'm feeling tired. I am exhausted. I'm exhausted, but yeah, I'll do it. I haven't uploaded anything on my channel for days now. I think I'm going to the second week without uplo uploading anything. And that is not what I want. That's not the standard that I want for my channel. I want to be able to, to upload a video every week. But guys, you're... It's a lot of work. But anyways, but anyways, right now I'm just gonna chill a bit. And then I'll get up, get up, fix myself, make myself look gorgeous, or sit down. Come on, come on, it. I don't know what I'm gonna vlog first. Whether it's a sit down or or what? I don't know. 
I'll see which one I'll upload first. I'll upload something though today. But I honestly, I, I, I think that it's going to be a sit-down show. Because to edit a vlog, it's quite a lot. Look at my baby, guys. She's growing so. Are you ignoring me now? And Kosi. <laughs> and she has hiccups. <laughs> I'm so tired. Okay, anyways, guys, without me boring you so much, I will see you later today. Let me just take care of my kid and try to fix myself for the sit down. Anyways, bye for now. Anytime now, she has color mine on because she's she, a few days from now she had these small rashes. Um, my baby is teething, guys, so I think that is the cause of the rash on her face. So I thought that today, let me just use the color mine on her. Anyways, I tried the reason why I looked so dolled up with earrings and everything on okay, just earrings, no makeup. It's because I wanted to do a sit down. I promise you guys sit down but then when I was trying to do the sit down my baby woke up guys you know it's not easy but yeah we move anyways I just finished feeding her and yeah just to get Hey, I'm not going to have a bonbon, but I'm not going to But, anyways, guys, stay tuned. Um, and we have come to the end of the video. I wanted to do a sit down, guys, but I couldn't do the sit down because when I was trying to do the sit down, my baby woke up and her big sister was not here, she was outside playing. And so I couldn't do the sit down. Um, I really want to do something formal about it because I wanted to talk about my experience with raising my daughter, my firstborn, alone with no assistance from her father. And I was saying that we should always tell our kids what's going on because I feel like what hurts our kids the most is us hiding the truth from them. Like guys, now I don't hide anything from my kids. Um, I want my kid to know what is going on, even when she will, when she's grown, 
she doesn't go find someone and expect everything to be rosy rosy it's fine when she's old enough she can go and find her father but then she will know that this is what her mother told her so she will have a uh, sort of an expectation of what to look forward to if the man changes fine that's good but still she won't get there and be shocked by maybe if maybe the guy gives her a cold shoulder or something so this is why i i want to tell my kids exactly especially my daughter it's my daughter in this instant my firstborn about whatever that is going on about the father being absent of course it's not my child's fault it's never her fault and fact that maybe the father doesn't want to be in her life doesn't mean that i don't want her to be in my life i want her to be in my life because if i didn't want her i would have aborted her or something but for the fact that i kept her it means that i wanted her so I wanted my kids. I don't care what the other parent does, but it's really painful what um, an absent parent, it could be a mother or a father, it's really painful what they do to our kids. Because um, no one have also experienced an absent father. But you know what? It's fine. But I feel like if you tell your child the truth, they won't be hurt. Even if they are 18 years from now and they think that, oh, I need to go find my dad. When they get there and their father gives them a cold shoulder or something, you've already warned them about that father. Not that you are teaching your kids to hate. I would never teach my daughter to hate her father. I mean, that is her father. I would never teach her to hate the father. But then I'll always tell her the truth because he, he runs away from his responsibility what makes you think that by keeping your child or by not telling the child the truth you are protecting her when 18 years from now the child will go looking for her father they shall come back crying because the father didn't pay any attention back to her because i feel like your relationship your parent you know it doesn't just grow okay i'm decided but now i'm gonna come to all grown up and everything then that you know so that is what i wanted to say but actually i was gonna say it in a more professional way that's why i even have earrings on because i wanted to do a sit down but i couldn't do it because okay, i'm a mother full-time mother so when my kids want me i have no choice to to be there but anyways i looked at this um I wrote something on Facebook. You know, I just don't want to leave things there. You know, this first um, or this quote that I saw on Facebook, it is for me because I also had an absent father. And it's just also for my daughter. Um, let me just look for it. Let me just look for it, guys. I even pinned it on my Facebook. So guys, if you're not following me on Facebook, please do follow me. I drop amazing content on Facebook and I show a lot of scriptures there as well. Anyways, it says um, Psalm 68 verse 5. A father to the fatherless, a defender of widow, is God, is God in his holy toiling. Of all the ways the Lord God Almighty could have chosen to relate to humanity, he chose the language of family. He could have described himself as a benevolent dictator, kind boss, or patient landlord, but instead he chose the word father. He presents himself as a father because we all know what a father is and does. Even if we did not have earthly fathers who treated us well, we have an intrinsic understanding of what a good father should be. God planted that understanding in our hearts. We all have a need to be loved, cherished, protected, and valued. Ideally, an earthly father will meet those needs, but even if he doesn't, God will. So God is the father to the fatherless. God is my father. 
God is also my daughter's father. So in whatever that you lack, God is whatever that you don't have. He is there to close up that void. So without a father, with a father, without a father, the show must go on, you know. And I think that single mothers, your trust or, 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 or your strength, draw your strength from God and you'll never be disappointed. That is what I do now. I draw my strength from God. I don't trust anyone, guys, because I do know that people change just like that. Um, so, anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed my vlog. Um, I hope it made sense. We had a great day. Today it was a human rights day. I was on holiday. I wasn't working. I said I'm not even gonna open that computer and work today. Um, I hope you guys had a good day too. And I hope that you enjoyed this day with your lovely families and, and everything. Anyways, I'll end my vlog here. And I'll say bye for now. I love you guys so much. Look at my daughter, she wants to say bye. Bye. <laughs> and my young one. Bye, Nanny. Say bye, vlog. Bye. Anyway, guys, bye. Thank you for watching. Thank you for tuning in. And we'll see you again next time. It's hard. That's how we learn to make love work. It's part.